Hello, diamond painting lovers. Lazy Retired Granny here. Today's date is Sunday, March 5th, 2023. And I have finally finished this diamond painting. And for those that have watched my prior whipping chats on this, you know it has been a struggle for me. And I had some issues, which I'll go through right in just a minute. But I did want to thank three, actually four, YouTubers that I listened to for helping me through this. The first one is Jeffrey Morrison. He does a lot of whip and chats. And they last about 30 minutes each. And he is has such a calming voice and just, you know, chats along and like he's talking to you. And so I really enjoyed that. That really kept me focused on the difficult parts of this one. The second person is Crafty Cat. And if you haven't visited her channel, go over there and, and uh, give her a like and subscribe. She just really gave me uplifting videos to watch. And yeah, she's just, um, her voice is just so bubbly. So that, that really helped me on this. And the next person is Enza's Diamond Paint Painting. And she was an inspiration in that she also, you know, does shout outs to um, some YouTubers and, you know, says positive words and whatnot. So that really helped me. And then the other person isn't a diamond painter and he's more focused towards kids but some of it's kind of related to adults and that's Chad Wild Clay and I've mentioned him before and he's a big YouTuber has a big following you know and he was had has I think seven or eight tumors in his back and um, they did surgery on his lower back and come to find out he has cancer. And, you know, he still just gets on there and you wouldn't even know that he was going through this trial in his life. And I believe starting tomorrow he starts radiation and hopefully that will shrink the tumors that are left and um, hopefully the cancer will go away. But yeah, he's he's one that you just want to listen to and he's just happy and he just doesn't even let on, you know, that he's in pain. So I would give him a whirl if you really need to listen to somebody that's going through life's challenges. Yeah. And then the fourth, no, fifth person, you know that my son had surgery on Monday, which I guess is kind of a standard procedure now for surgery. He had his gallbladder removed, but there was complications. And a stone was caught, went through his gallbladder and was caught in one of the, um, I don't know, little pipes that go out of there. And they had to do additional surgery to get that out. And that is not something that's standard procedure. So we ended up spending the night at the hospital and um, he, he got to come home, but he has a tube 
that's still connected for the drainage and whatnot. But even though he's going through, I know he's in pain or has been, it's getting a little better, but he has just stayed so positive and no complaining. And, you know, I'm always over there. I'm worrying all the time. And so I'm always over there to see what I can help him with and whatnot. And um, he's just got on with life um, slowly, but he hasn't done any complaining or, you know, moaning and being depressed. So I'm real proud of him. He's done really good. Okay, so now to get into this painting. This painting I bought from Amazon back in October of 2021. It's no longer available. It has 20 colors. It's a 40 by 30. And I paid $3.97 for it. Okay, the good stuff about it, I'm done with it, so that's good. I had enough drills, so that's good. The problem with this is that this down here was not readable. And thank you to a couple people who said, yeah, go ahead and do this. I had done this, and they said, don't leave that blue. Take them out and put in, you know, some light-colored uh, drills in there. So I did. So now you can read it. Before, it was a dark blue and you just could not read it at all. The second thing, um, with it, five and six were so close in color that you couldn't read those numbers. And come on, y'all. Come on, girl. Come on. Sorry, my dog decided to throw up. I had to let her outside and I can watch her. She got upset this morning because she had to have her monthly trifexis and it's this big horse pill and I have to jam it down her throat and she shakes and oh brother. Um, so I think hopefully she didn't throw that up. Okay. Um, Let's see, where was I? So the, the canvas was, you know, kind of unreadable. And so I was having to get my dollar store readers out constantly. So that wasn't too much fun. This took me over 15 hours to complete. I started it on March 2nd and finished it today. But I just wanted it done. And I was... If it hadn't have been those YouTubers that I was listening to while I was doing this, it would be in the trash right now. That's just how bad it was. <laughs> so, <clears throat> but I got it done and I did, oh, the other thing on this, if, if I could make changes to this other than what I've already said, I think I would have made this part maybe a white or off-white. And I don't know, just change the colors around a little bit. I'm just, I'm not real happy with all the colors in this, but it looked better when I ordered it than the finished product, if that makes sense. But yeah, so I'm glad it's done. And when I'm done with this video, I'm gonna put it to bed, get out the next one, which is a similar one to this. But before I start it, I am going to 
make sure that I don't have the same issues with it that I had with this one. Um, it is a little bit different, so I think it'll be fine. But time to put this one to bed and on with another one. <laughs> okay, I think that is all I want to say. Hopefully my camera does not play tricks on me again and go into a different mode. Oh, I don't know, my last video, I couldn't believe it. I went in there and it's like, what? It's supposed to be on full. And it decided to change itself. So hopefully I don't have to do this one over again. All right, that's all I have. Thanks for watching and talk to you soon.